Hi guys. Hi guys, Merry Christmas to you. Today is the 25th of December, which means that yesterday we celebrated Christmas here in Denmark. So me and my wife and my two kids and our dogs celebrated Christmas here in our home in Copenhagen, in Vesterbo, in our apartment. So today is a hangover day because of the Christmas food, the Danish Christmas food, and also because of the gift race that you get started when you start to open presents. Anyway, I got a request a couple of videos ago so that I should take the Sony 70 to 200 f.4 out and do some night shots. And I of course wanted to, to do this to please my audience. And I had this idea that I should take the lens and my camera to Tivoli to take some photos there because I thought it would look pretty with all the Christmas light. And if you don't know Tivoli, Tivoli is a very old amusement park in the middle of Copenhagen. Anyway, what happened here in Denmark was that due to COVID, we started to lock down some of the society again. And last Friday, the government decided to lock down theme parks, zoos, and other kinds of cultural institutions. That meant that I had from Friday to Sunday to go and take photos in Tivoli. So of course, I decided to go really quickly. I packed my camera and I went into Tivoli. And I hope you are going to enjoy these photos. I really wasn't inspired that much because I kind of rushed it, but I think I got some decent photos. I think you will see in this video that the limits of this lens is the f.4 stop when it's dark. There wasn't really a lot of light, even though there are a lot of Christmas light in Tivoli and trying to handheld a, a 200 millimeter lens isn't that easy. Also because I had to use some really slow shutter speeds because of the lack of light. I haven't written any settings on the photos here in the video, but almost every photo I took in this video was shot at f4 with an ISO around 3200. And I used, uh, of course, different uh, shutter speeds, but I was shooting around 115, 130, 1 over 60 most of the times. So handheld this was not really easy. And I did delete some photos, of course, because they were blurry. But I also did get some good photos that were sharp, but had some sort of grain or noise in them because of the high ISO. I hope you can see this in the video. I'm not sure you can do this because of compression, but perhaps you can see the limits and you will notice that for yourself and consider that if you ever consider buying this sort of lens. Now let's get into the video.
Thank you for watching this video through. I really hope you enjoyed it and that you got something out of it. If you would like to make my Christmas a very nice and good Christmas, you could subscribe to my channel. That will really mean a lot to me. Also, you could leave a like on this video or consider giving a comment. Perhaps you could tell me which photo you like the most and let me know what you think about the more creative edits that I did. Anyway, perhaps we will see each other before New Year's Eve. If not, then you should take care and I will see you in the next year. Bye.